were interviewed about menstruation, a choral thing began to occur, a kind of wild collective song. Women echoed each other. The voices bled into one another. <laughs> I was 12. My mother slapped me. Second grade, seven years old. My brother was talking about periods. I didn't like the way he was laughing. So I asked my mother, what's a period, I asked. It's punctuation, she says. You put it at the end of a sentence. My father bought me a card to my little girl who isn't so little anymore. I was terrified. My mother showed me the thick sanitary napkins. I was to bring the used ones to the can under the kitchen sink. I remember being one of the last. I was 13. We all wanted it to come. I was so afraid, I started putting the used pads in brown paper bags in dark storage places under the roof. Eighth grade, my mother said, oh, that's nice. <laughs> Junior high, round trips before it came. Coincided with a little hair under my arms, which grew unevenly. One arm didn't have hair, the other didn't. I was 16, sort of scared. My mother gave me coding. We had bunk beds. I lay down and lay there. My mother was so uncomfortable. One night I came home late and snuck into bed without turning on any lights. My mother had found the used pads and put them between the sheets of my bed. I was 12 years old, still in my underpants. Hadn't gotten dressed. Looked down on the staircase. There it was. Looked down and I saw blood. Seventh grade, my mother sort of noticed my underwear. Then she gave me plastic diapers. My mom was very warm. Let's get you a pad. My friend Marcia, they celebrated when she got hers. They had dinner for her. <laughs> we all wanted our period. We all wanted it now. 13 years old. It was before Kotex. Had to watch her dress. I was black and poor. Blood on the back of my dress in church. Didn't show, but I was guilty. I was 10 and a half. No preparation. Brown guck on my underpants. She showed me how to put in a tampon. Only got in halfway. I associated my period with inexplicable phenomena. My mother told me I had to use a rag. My mother said no to tampons. You couldn't put anything in your sugar dish. <laughs> <laughs> Wore wads of cotton, told my mother. She gave me Elizabeth Taylor paper dolls. Fifteen years old, my mother said, Mazel tov. She slapped me in the face. Didn't know if it was a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> <laughs> my period? Like cake mix before it's baked. Indians sat on moss for five days. Wish I were Native American. I was 15 and I'd been hoping to get it. I was tall and I kept growing. When I saw white girls in the gym with tampons, I thought they were bad girls. Saw little red drops on the pink tiles and I said, yeah. I'm almost like <laughs> green. Used LB and I liked putting my fingers up there. 11 years old, wearing white pants. Blood started to come out. Thought it was dreadful. I'm not ready. I got back pain. I got horny. 12 years old, I was happy. My friend had a Ouija board, asked when we were going to get our periods, looked down, and I saw blood. Looked down, and there it was. I'm a woman. Terrified. Never thought it would come. Changed my whole feeling about myself. I became very silent and mature. A good Vietnamese woman. Quiet worker, virtuous, never speaks. Nine and a half. I was sure I was bleeding to death. Rolled up my underwear and threw them in a corner. Didn't want to worry my parents. My mother made me hot water and wine, and I fell asleep. I was in my bedroom in my mother's apartment. I had a comic book collection. My mother said, you mustn't lift your box of comic books. <laughs> my girlfriends told me to hemorrhage every month. My mother was in and out of mental hospitals. She couldn't take me coming of age. Dear Miss Carling, please excuse my daughter from basketball. <laughs> she has just matured. <laughs> <laughs> At camp, they told me not to take a bath with my period. They wiped me down with antiseptic. <laughs> Scared people would smell it. Scared they'd say, I smell like fish. Throwing up, couldn't eat. I got hungry. Sometimes it's very red. I like the drops that drop in the toilet, like paint. Sometimes it's brown and it disturbs me. I was 12. My mother slapped me and brought me a red cotton shirt. My father went out for a bottle of sangria. 